This is the battery connection kit for twin auxiliary batteries. Part of this kit are two Amtron lithium batteries. You can choose uh, in between 100 amp hour, 150 amp hour and two 200 amp hour batteries. So always be two batteries. Uh, they've both or they all have 175 amp continuous rating. So with two batteries, uh, we also got extra cables where you can link the batteries together, which will give you a maximum continuous discharge of 350 amp from this battery bank. And you will get uh, either a combined amp hour rating of 200, 300, or 400 amp hours, depending on what batteries you choose. Uh, it's important to know you can only choose the same batteries. So use, you choose two 100s, two 150s, or two 200s. Uh, the way you put this kit together is you use the kit that comes with it to actually bolt battery negative to battery negative. You use the short cables for that. They are the link cables and then you bolt battery positive to battery positive. That links the batteries together. And then you use the big cable to go from either battery, doesn't matter which one you use, positive to this twin ANL fuse holder. You can screw that on here. One side has got a bus bar on it. That's where you connect the battery to. And then you can add ANL fuses in here. The ANL fuses are not part of this kit. So please choose the fuses that are right for you. Or if you choose any of the installation kits that we've got, they will then already come with the right fuses and the right amount of fuses. If you choose the fuses yourself, choose the ones that you need. And then don't forget, you've got spare fuse slots on the side here. So you add spare fuses as well. Just in case you blow a fuse out in the middle of nowhere, you've got a spare right there when you need it. Uh, once you've connected that together, positive is on. You can then, let's see if this holds. Yeah, looks good. You can then use uh, the other cable, the black one for battery negative. And the way that will go is you use the same battery that you've just come off and you connect that, unlike I'm doing here at the moment, was just for you know, showing you what's happening. Uh, this will go from battery negative to the shunt or to your negative junction start, whatever you're using. Shunt or junction start are not part of this kit. You can buy them separately. A good choice would be a Victron Smart Shunt or a Victron BMV 712 battery monitor or just in case you use a Manager 30 kit, it will have a shunt built in there as well. So you screw that on there, onto the battery, and you screw the other side onto the shunt. And from there on, you can connect the rest of your system. Uh, please find more information in the description. Uh, it's got a list of all the bits and pieces that are in there. And more information on the separate products as well.